We're back at Roctagon 27. Time for the big boys to take center cage. Heavyweight action, we sent it up to Jake Digman to bring out the fighters. The following contest is in the Roctagon MMA Amateur Heavyweight Division, and it is brought to you by Hood Mart, your one-stop hood shop. Introducing first, making his way down the aisle into the red corner, please welcome Tony Hodges. Tony Hodges, 29 years old, has had a bit of, a bit of an up and down career. At one point, Tony Hodges was one of the top fighters in the area as he uh, started off 3-0, knockout guillotine decision, and then went on a bit of a, a tough slide against excellent competition, though. At one point, the, the three of his four losses were to opponents with a combined record of 21 and one. Three of the four losses that are to fighters who hold titles. So certainly Tony Hodges has been in there with some excellent competition. Usually a light heavyweight fighting at 205. He steps up to take a fight with Tyree Johnson. Tony Hodges has uh, said what's important for him. To get back into his winning ways is having a different mindset. Very important to him. Let's see if he turns it around today. We send it up to Jake to bring out Tony's opponent. And his opponent making his way down the aisle to the blue corner. Please welcome Tyree Johnson. Tyree Johnson from Comarts. Comarts MMA in Cleveland, Ohio. Comes in with a record of two and six. Started off his career with a bang. Let's take a look at the, the outdoor option tail of the tape. Tony Hodges, four years the elder of Tyree Johnson and holds a six inch reach advantage. Tyree Johnson though, the much heavier fighter. And Tony Hodges only with the two inch reach. Only 5'7", 223, a real fire plug. As I mentioned, he started his fight with a 10-second knockout. Oh, Tyree Johnson, it was just a right hook coming in. He's got huge power in his hands. But he's on a four-fight win, losing streak, all of those by submission. Let's get Jake Digman back in the cage for our official introductions. The following contest is in the Roctagon MMA Amateur Heavyweight Division, and it is brought to you by Hoodmart, your one-stop hood shop. Introducing first in the red corner, he fights out of Lorraine, Ohio. He weighed in at 207 pounds, representing Team Hodges with an MMA record of three wins, four losses. Please welcome Tony Hodges. His opponent in the blue corner, he fights out of Cleveland, Ohio. He weighed in at 223 pounds, representing Palmart's Fight Club with an MMA record. Two wins, three losses. Please welcome Tyree Johnson. This bout is scheduled for three three-minute rounds. And when the action begins, your referee is Mr. Victor Ventresca. Tony Hodges, Black Fight Trunks, Tyree Johnson. White and purple fight trucks, Victor Ventresca, third man in the cage. I'm Ryan Cavanaugh, joined once again by UFC vet Forrest Pets, and it's Hodges who comes in with the right. Both these guys looking to throw pants, and they both are heavy punchers, Forrest. Yeah, they're both starting pretty fast. Both big guys, both of them strong. Hodges looks a bit more athletic, but sometimes uh, appearances are deceiving. Hodges usually fights at 205, but it's easy for him to move up as Tyree Johnson is a fairly light heavyweight at only 220, 223. Tyree Johnson looking for the takedown. A nice body shot in there. Yeah, that, I like to that see a guy him. makes it up like that. Hodges is throwing some heavy leather. Tyree Johnson just trying to weather the storm here. Sure, but you know, Hodges doesn't look like a guy who's gonna tire anytime. He is very fit. 
As Johnson, credit to Johnson, working his way back up to the cage, and Hodges looks for the takedown again. Right, both of these guys have had uh, a few fights. Uh, seven for Hodges. Oh, Tyree Johnson just drops to a knee, and, and he's tapping the strikes. Uh, it looks like a, it looks like a right hand, a right uppercut from Hodges uh, landed uh, that that did some damage to the eye of Johnson. I don't know if he hurt his orbital. I mean, it looked like a clean punch to me, so I, 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 there's no way it was a, a finger. But uh, sometimes, sometimes that's all it takes. He certainly came in and, and looked to be hurt. We'll see what take a look at what happened here, Forrest. I think it's a, a as you said, an uppercut here from Hodges. Two. And yeah, right no. there, Tyree Johnson goes down. That's a big uppercut. Yeah. Yeah, that was solid. He had all his weight into it. Um, I mean, it, it definitely, in my opinion, it was a clean punch. I, we really didn't get a great look at it, but um, but that's what I think happened. Oh, I, think he, I think he did some damage maybe to the orbital of Johnson. Yeah, well, that was three consecutive uppercuts which looked to land on Johnson, and he Start tapping the cage, tapping the canvas, tapping anything he could to put an end to that because Tony Hodges, he packs a punch in there. Yeah, the guy can crack, that's for sure. We send it up to Jake Digman for the official announcement of our winner. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner at one minute and nine seconds of the first round by TKO, Tony Hodges! Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with your winner, Tony Hodges. Tony, very impressive. Uh, did you, you came in here wanting to stand. Did you feel like you could knock him out? Yeah, I felt like I could knock him out. I just came out aggressive. What are you planning to do? Take it out quick. Before the fight, you said you were coming out with a different mindset. Uh, how did that translate inside the Roxagon tonight? I mean, it was working. It worked. You know, I've been training to have a totally different mindset when I come into the ring. And um, I'm going to keep on carrying it out, you know, next fight. You usually fight at 205, and you showed up here, took a fight at heavyweight. Where can we expect to see you fighting next? 205 or 185. Tony, anybody you want to thank out there? It's my team. My team and everybody out here coming in uh, Roctagon for having me. Roctagon would love to see you back here inside the cage. One more time for your winner by knockout, Tony Hodges.